Dabney S. Lancaster Community College can help you get the training you need in areas like CDL, welding, healthcare, and more for the career you want in as little as eight weeks. Ask about our many tuition assistance options. Enroll today. Start here. Start now. To the ribbon cutting celebration today for Rollner Smokehouse. We appreciate you being here. Um, we appreciate you helping us with this celebration and, um, and Mr. Dilly's investment in the community. Um, we're very appreciative of that and we're so excited to celebrate today uh, with uh, him and uh, get the, help get the word out about the facility here. So, at this uh, time, it's my pleasure to introduce Lori Barber, who's the president of the Chamber Board. Well, good morning, and what a great turnout we had today. We are so glad to have you here in Iron Gate and another um, restaurant in our community. Thank you so much for investing in uh, here in our community, and we're, we're just glad to have everybody here. Can't wait to, to have you full time and um, use your services. So, thank you. Okay, and at this time, I'd like to introduce Chuck Unroe, who's the mayor here in Iron Gate. Kenny and Lisa, I just want to welcome you to Iron Gate, and I can't tell you how thankful we are to have y'all as members of our community here, and that y'all chose Iron Gate to be the home for your base for your operation. You know, one of the good side effects for us is we get to smell it all the time, <laughs> and that just makes you want to come up the hill that much more often. So that's a good thing. But I, I, I want to share just one little thought with you that I, I realized the other day, and it was last week, a couple of days before the Fourth of July, and I rode by here, and your porch was full of people, just like it is right now, and they were all eating great food couple small children walking around and I thought you know what a gathering place there's probably some local people here some folks traveling to stop and get a quick bite and maybe the locals are giving them some information about points of interest around here but it was just a great it looked like a great setting and a great place for people to come together share good food some exchange of conversation and friendship and to me, that's what small town life is supposed to be. And I, I thought, what a great thing to have as you come right into the opening entrance of Iron Gate is a place like that for folks to come to and feel comfortable and to be. So on behalf of the town and everybody here, thank you for coming. Thank you for being here. We wish you many years of great success and we'll try to help you as much as we can along the way. Thank you. Tom Savold, representing the city of Covington. Congratulations. What all Chuck said, he's right. I appreciate you investing in Allegheny Highlands. Iron Gates is a wonderful place. I've sat in this back room many a time with Alan, and we solved the problems of the world. Uh, I don't know if he ever told me the truth, but we right. solved the problems of the world. <laughs> I always told him his mouth was moving his lines. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations, appreciate what you're doing here. Uh, look at you every time I come through. I know you're here, so keep you in mind. I'll stop and grab something. I appreciate it. Congratulations. Thank you. And Richard Shaw will be rep representing Allegheny County. On behalf of John Lambert, <coughs> Allegheny County School oh, and uh, all of the Board of Supervisors, welcome you to the town of Warren Gate. It's a great place to be where you're at. I've heard nothing but great things about your product. And it's awesome that you took the chose to be here. And I'm sure it'll be an asset to Iron Gate and Allegheny County. When we uh, when we <laughs> when we <laughs> Jeff Irvin is going to represent the town of Clinton Forge. On behalf of the town of Clinton Forge, congratulations. We hope you're nothing but great success here at our game. Like you say, it's a beautiful place and you picked a good place to go other than Clinton Forge and maybe Covey. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, if we can do anything, let us know. Maybe roll it up our cooking sometime. And we, we can smell it from up there. So, if you need anything, let us know. Thank you. Thank you. So, uh, Ken, would you like to say a few words? Well, I just, 
thank some more for turning out. And uh, I'd like to thank my brother-in-law, Roger Brown, and my sister, Susan Brown. <laughs> Jack Hammond. He's in here somewhere. Hi, Jerry. <laughs> Jack Hammond, Mr. Hammond. Clarence Kellison. Little man. No. <laughs> Where's Samora? She's hiding. She's hiding. <laughs> but all of y'all, you know, I couldn't be here without y'all. There's Samora, she's hiding. <laughs> she's just a baby. But uh, all we want to do is make a living and make people happy. Rock on. <laughs> Well, again, we appreciate the investment you've made here in the Allegheny Highlands. We wish you much success and much luck with this. Um, check out the menu. Check out the food while you're here. Great um, opportunity to reach out to the ham for any catering um, <coughs> business that you might need in the future. Um, just, um, again, pick up a menu while you're here. So we are, congratulate you, and um, I think we'll all step out front so we can get the, um, actually host the picture for the ribbon cutting, okay? Y'all all ready for this? <laughs> yeah. I know I damn Let's do it. <laughs> Congratulations. Uh,